I can promise you one thing. If you watch this video till the end, you'll be playing When My Train Pulls In by Gary Clark Jr. Something like... <laughs> Thanks for taking your time out and welcome to the Guitar Broadcast. My name is Shiva Rabbani and if you're new here, you can consider subscribing to the channel to the link button over there down in the corner. Yeah. Done subscribing? Let's get to the song. This riff and the song in classic E minor pentonic scale and the pattern which means 1, 3, 4 or E, A and B. If you have any confusion regarding 12 bar blues, you can check out the link in the card. Let's start with the riff, which is the main part of the song, and after that we'll go for the complete song. Let's divide the riff into two parts. One part is this, and second part. This is kind of first tone uh, uh, Gary Clark used in the song, I'm sure. Not just plain distortion, it's added with the fuzz. So, Let's start with the first part of the riff. It starts with the hammer on from the open A to the B note on the A string. Then right after that you go for the open D. So hammer on from A to B and open D real slow and after these three notes you come back on the A string and again from the open A to B but while doing the second hammer on you go for this G note on the E string so first hammer on open D hammer on G Hammer on, open D, hammer on, G. Let's start with the second part. It's a open D and it hammers on on the E note on the D string. And after that you go for the open E and you come back again for the E note on the D string. Hammer on, open E, E. D to E, hammer on, open E, and again E on the D string. Real slow. Complete riff. Ends on the E note on the D string. Real slow. Once you're over with the riff, now let's go for the complete song. This complete song is a 12 bar blues pattern, which means the four bars on your riff. And after that you go for the two bar on the A minor. You come back again for the two more bars on the riff. And after that you go for the one bar on the B minor and one bar on A minor and the last two bar again on the riff. For the complete song you can check out the description. Thanks for watching guys and if you have anything to add good or bad doesn't matter just don't keep it to yourself just let it out in the comment box. I'm sure that's why they're there for. 
and I'll see you soon in the next video. And please, please, please don't forget subscribing. Take care.